I accidentally <laughs> stuck an axe in the back of a guy's head. I didn't mean to, though. I was aiming for his shoulder. As you guys head down, uh, Jester, as you were the first person down, the first thing you notice is uh, at the bottom of the steps, you see the fellow with the axe stuck in him, slowly crawling. He's not dead. <gasps> He's not dead. <gasps> Heal him. I, I'm out of spells. Oh. Um, Take the axe out of his head. That's what I'm saying. Is it better to pull it out or leave it in place it? like is a plug? Like a punch Which one is it? I can't Can I cast? I'll ask him. Would you like us to leave the axe in or take it out? <laughs> begins to like crawl quicker no, away from no, you. Like, no, no. I hold on to his ankles. <laughs> it's just like his fingernails are scraping against know, the wood floor. I know, it's really terrible. I'm sorry that I did this. I hope you're okay. Can't you do any healing? Or I mean, I can cast spare the dying, but he's kind of already not. Spared? Yeah. Dying. Okay. That's when he passes out. I can't oh. spare the dying. Okay. <laughs> We're just going to leave the hole in his head like Phineas Gage? Well, I think if, you know, maybe Deuce could do something about it. Upstairs? Yeah, yeah, yeah. See if he'll come down here. All right, for I'll run up there and get him. I'm just going to move the axe head just like a centimeter or don't, two. Don't move the axe. What if his brain starts leaking out? Don't do it. <laughs> If you press on it, can you get his hand to move? <laughs> <laughs> That's so messed up. <laughs> so not as you rush up uh, to the. Uh...